हेलो माय अमेजिंग फ्रेंड आई एम डॉक्टर पूर्ति त्रिवेदी आपकी साथी आज एक सक्सेसफुल वेबिनार हम लोगों ने किया फ्रॉम द एच टी मीडिया टेक टीम दैट वी प्रिपेयर अ वेबिनार द टॉपिक ऑफ द वेबिनार इज हाउ इफेक्टिवली यू कैन प्रिपेयर योर सीवी और रिज्यूमे आई हैव हाईलाइटेड ऑल द टेक्निक्स एंड द स्किल्स दैट इज रिक्वायर्ड टू प्रिपेयर इफेक्टिव सीवी बिकॉज़ देयर आर थाउजेंड्स ऑफ द एप्लीकेंट इज अवेलेबल Out of thousands of the applications, your CV is required to be shortlisted. And how it will be shortlisted? I have given all the informations. If you didn't uh, get that informations, you just uh, see our YouTube channels, and you will find all the details. Also, uh, along with that, we have discussed that effective interview skills. How effectively in, uh, you can answer few of the FAQs questions or how you can crack your interview effectively so uh, this is just uh, again the summarizations and few of the tips and techniques how to face an interview and uh, what are the do's and don'ts you are required to uh, do during the interview so when you are appearing for any of the job interview keep in mind that your appearance will create an initial impressions in the minds of interviewer it should not be like that you wear a you know a dark orange color shirt or dark uh, you know black color like that kind of the shirt or fluorescent kind of the shirt because it uh, it it should not be that uh, again few of the girls who are going for the interview that dress should be in uh, you know very much formal wear if they wear shirts trousers then that will be fine otherwise in the indian traditional suits if they wear it then that also should suit that personality so your dressing is the first and foremost thing you need to take care keep in mind that whether in if you are working in any of the professional job or if you are applying for professional job and you are going for an interview you have to wear a tie and yes the wearing a tie uh, that thing is also very much important because few of the persons don't know how to wear a tie and they wear a tie up to like you know chest or uh, few of the like uh, it's very long that should not be there that thing you need to uh, uh, take care make the first impressions to the last impression because it is considered that any of the interviewer will judge you in the first 20 second and it is generally a thumb rule that uh, in the 20 seconds any of the persons can judge you from your appearance from your uh, behavior and all so initial preparations before your personal interview will definitely generate the confidence in within you uh, if you are not comfortable comfortable with the clothes you wear it or if you are not comfortable with uh, any of the thing then that will uh, lose your confidence and ultimately it influence when you are against the interviewer and uh, uh, giving an answer to your questions so here are few of the basic tips and tricks that uh, how some interview questions will help you to clear your job interview just one minute please yes uh, here are few of the do's and don'ts that dress properly for the job interview wear a decent formal pant uh, and uh, light color shirt like uh, this way if you are you, uh, you can able to see that the do's that is light color shirts and tie and don't like a dark color shirt your attire is so that you take uh, the interview seriously and you are interested for that position and know the locations and exact time of the interviewer sometimes it happens that uh, uh, if you are late and if interviewer is waiting it doesn't look good so just the idea uh, request is to arrive just before 10 to 15 minutes early to the schedule times and yes interviewer is continuously observing that whether you are on the time or not it doesn't matter if they are late it's okay but yes you are required to be on the time now few of the do's of the job interview is ask the permissions to enter the interview room and greet the employer with a smile so this is the basic thing i have also discussed in my webinar that your smiles uh, uh, you know will uh, uh, makes your half work done so if you greet it with the smile not only in the interviewer but if you are meeting to any of the unknown persons and if you want the support from that person 
or for example if you are in the sales field and uh, if you are going to any of the unknown that is the first time customer and if you greet greet it with the smiles definitely your impressions is uh, changed in the mind of the interviewer or uh, those persons you are meeting so greet with the smile don't hesitate to offer a handshake or make an eye contact with the employer yes give give few times let us time to be a subtle ones and uh, just uh, don't say just like go over then hi i am uh, whatsoever the name of your so uh, don't be hesitate just be polite and just greet them hello sir i am uh, you know, whatsoever so when uh, and again one more tips i would like to give you when interviewer will tell you that uh, tell me something about yourself never ever start yourself with that Uh, hello myself purti trivedi hello myself dr purti trivedi no like that you just have to always start it with hello sir i am dr purti trivedi not myself say i am because this is the this is one kind of the rule that uh, if you say it is myself it doesn't look a uh, perfect way when you are giving informations about yourself sit straight on the chair avoid crossing your hands or a leg yes it is that your body language speaks so never ever when you talk with the uh, interviewer just talk with your open hands that shows that you are a good person and that is one kind of the personality part among one uh, you need not to put your cross hand like this you need not to few, uh, uh, use a pen and just uh, use a pen like tick tick uh, if you are doing don't do that and uh, or don't uh, continuously move your hands and legs it doesn't suits to the personality and that uh, express that you are discomfortable and so on so that shows that you are uh, not that much confident don't ask some questions related to your applied job this will show your interest in the position some question related to your applied job or uh, definitely few of the interviewer will ask but um, yes uh, you can answer accordingly so this thing you have to take care don't uh, few of the don'ts that you are required to take care that do not chew a chingam in the interview we have seen that in few of the areas any person is having a habit of a smoking they just smoke outside and when they go inside uh, the interviewer chambers uh, it smells uh, very bad and few interviewers don't like it so they may, will not offer you for that job don't depend on your job applications to uh, get your hired it will not be happen like that you need to market your specialized traits and skills during the personal interview nothing like that uh, the interviewer will observe everything and accordingly they will decide your selection will completely depend on your performance of the interview uh, uh, it is also not uh, exactly like that do not smoke before the interview as uh, this thing i have already taken you few of the persons is having a you know habit of chewing uh, chewing tobacco uh, tobacco like that so oh, never ever uh, use that kind of the things uh, when you are going for an interview don't interact with the employer as if you are not in need of that job and you have a plenty of offers in the row yes because if you are applying for the job if you are going for the interview that itself express that you are in the need of the job so never ever over emphasize that you are badly in need of that job and simultaneously never uh, uh, so so over confident that uh, if you if the interviewer will not provide you that job you have uh, so many jobs is uh, laying along with you and you will get it uh, so be, just to be humble also don't so that you are too desperate for the job that i have already con uh, considered stay calm and answer the interviewer questions properly and carefully uh, see you you should have to be a good listener because sometimes if continuously you are telling 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 like that then then also the there will create another uh, negative impact on against interviewer so take care of that do not lie in the interview employer may cross check your the informations by contra uh, contacting your previous employer or uh, reference provided yes sometimes it happens that uh, you uh, if interviewer will ask you about the reference you provide wrong reference or few of the things you have provided are uh, wrong 
so if you have been to on a wrong it is 100% certain that you will not be get a job that job so and yes again in the future also any of the that organizations will never give you uh, or never provide you the job so please take care of uh, it be honest and uh, just be humble whatsoever you know just tell them never bluff never say wrong and just be honest there are some basic but important tips to you during the meeting with the employer you can also go through the sample interview questions and get appropriate answer of them and with all these interview tips you will definitely make a good impressions in the minds of the recruiter and uh, yes uh, uh, in the depth we have provided all the effective questions majority of the questions that is from the behavioral part we are, we have discussed in depth so i just request if you are interested and if you want it to know further just to see our uh, that uh, you know webinar you will come to know everything and also you will come to know how effectively you can make your cv uh, don't forget to put up in the comment box that whether you like it or not like it so thank you so much bye for now thank you jai hind